I'm not too sure if anyone expected this, but well, I'll say you. I'll tell you in a minute. Hello everyone, welcome to Adisat Gaming Time, where today we're just talking about two things. Intro. Okay, because this is one of the things I forgot to mention in my last Gaming Time video, I just want to say that uh, Secret Neighbor is an official multiplayer game in lines with Hello Neighbor. Now, I can't remember what time it's set, but you either could play as a kid or the neighbor itself, and you basically have to rescue um, one of the person that is trapped in the house. Now, I don't know when it's going to be coming out, but you can sign up for Alphas now for the PC. And yeah, Stranger Things will be getting a Telltale game. Now, before I go on my computer and actually read you the full moments thing with the full details, because there's actually not much, um, I think this news is amazing. Now, there are two Stranger Things uh, games. Well, there's a like a 8-bit one that you can download for your mobile devices, and also there's a PlayStation VR one, which I will be playing shortly because we're doing this announced and I am a bit <laughs> okay so Netflix and Telltale a video game developer and publisher confirmed that they're partnering on two projects a Stranger Things game in the works which which is launching on on the Telltale platform in addition the Minecraft story mode a five episode interact into Adventure is coming to Netflix, and I forgot to mention that also. Um, uh, Stranger Things also has a Minecraft um, mods and all of that, which you can purchase. But it says here, exclusive Netflix to add games to its service, including Stranger Things and Minecraft. I, uh, Okay, I don't know what that means. Um, one of these other tweets says, Talk to Netflix can confirm that Minecraft Story Mode will be coming to the streaming service this fall. Will be a five part episodic series similar to the original game, but adapted, but adapted for similar controls. Stranger Things won't be a choose your own uh, adventure game kind of makes sense, rather, rather a game on the Telltale's own platform and then I guess this is from Telltale Games. We're delighted by the response we we, we are receiving to the idea of, Netf of Mark. Minecraft story mode coming to Netflix in the fall as an interactive adventure. Separately we are thrilled, we are thrilled to confirm that Telltale is developing a game based on Stranger Things that we will publish to consoles and computers at a later date. I'm hoping that will be sometime in 2019 because that's when season 3 is coming. Apparently it's supposed to be the end for Stranger Things then. So yeah. On the partner our partnership with Netflix is something that we are incredibly proud of. And while we don't have any more to share whites now, we are excited to fill details on these projects later in the year. So yeah, Netflix is doing that, Telltale is doing that, and I think it's all amazing. I know Telltale has confirmed that we're getting Stranger, a Stranger Things game is quite amazing that the, the closest thing to a game that we ever got was the PlayStation VR thing and I'm ho I am I just don't know it's just going to be really cool to see how it all ends up and what the story will be about and one of the things I think they need to do is get the original actors that play like for instance these characters in Stranger Things to this one which I will be making a video called the top five things that Telltale needs to do in the Stranger Things game. One of them being get those voice actors but it's never that simple it's never that simple because like 
let's look at that IMDB pages and see if they've been doing much and see if all this other stuff. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I guess I'll see you on the next one. Peace and see ya and I guess this is going on Friday. Happy weekend.